Hello, everyone. Welcome to the training sessions "Parse with Octopus" in three minutes. In this tutorial, we will walk you through how to benefit from cloud extraction. Okay, so that's all for today's demonstration. So now I'm going to talk a little bit about our cloud extraction. So before telling that, it is for you know, paid users only. So for those of you who paid for standard plans or above would have access for that. Okay, so very simple. Why would you need cloud extraction? Basically, there are five features for you. So for the first one, for your local device, cloud extraction is using our cloud server. So it has nothing to do with your local network but only connected to our end. You can simply start cloud extraction and close the octopus, or even shut down your PC to do anything else you want. Second of all, you can hide your IP. As tasks run in the cloud server, they will use our cloud IPs to access the web pages. So your local IP will be protected. So that's the most important thing. Uh, you can also have high scraping speed. Of course, cloud extraction can speed up the um, scraping six to 10 times local runs by splitting the task into subtasks and running the multiple you know, subtasks at the same time. So you can also get flexible data connection. You can connect cloud data with a third party platform to output the collected data for other needs with our API or Zapier. And also you can update the data on a recurring basis. You can schedule the task to run at any frequency you want, like daily, weekly, or monthly. So that's all about our schedule extraction. Okay, so let's get back to the octopus. If you are working for a security company or you are just monitoring price fluctuation from time to time, and you need to understand the importance of schedule run. You know, schedule feature is exactly for you. You can set, for example, every day, you know, once weekly, monthly, you can select day of the month at a certain time of the um, every day, of course. And if we want to just, you know, for example, just repeat, click on repeat, and you can run every one minute, five minutes, etc. So, it is a very good tool to monitor the fluctuation or the changes of certain figures.